Hi there, I'm just uh, mending some songbird amps here and they are, let me get this one, so a Wem songbird, so it's got the, um, I suppose it's designed so that you stand behind it, it's got a load of inputs like four line inputs and two, one with high and low impedance and one High impedance and one accordion input because it's uh, designed for accordions with kind of MIDI and backing tracks and other stuff to go in the other inputs. Anyway, they had a bit of a design fault and the speaker cones, the 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 um the foam perishes like this on them, and you can sometimes fix it with new foam like that or put a new cone in. But this one, you can, the, the cone is perished and you can feel it's all sticky and horrible. And I just thought we'd throw something, because it works at the moment, but I reckon if you play anything loud, it'll probably break. So I thought I might make a quick video. This is actually an extension speaker and it's being powered by that amp over there. I've put the amp further away so we can hear this speaker because you obviously they're about the same volume. And I thought I thought a drum machine would probably do it with a good loud kick drum. So here we go. Let's see if we can see if we can break this speaker by. You can probably see it moving now. It's pretty loud. Go and turn it up on the amp, see if we can break it. Uh -huh. right, turn it up more on the amp. loud these amps yeah, it definitely doesn't like that where's this one over there it's fine Having said that, turn it down again, it's fine again. I think we've got to replace it though, it will go. I can see it cracking at so they don't um, ruin the coil. Right, there you go. Speaker destructed. Right, here we are again. Here's the, uh, here's the comb we just destroyed. And um, so this will need a new, uh, what do they call it? Foam, foam ring, foam outer. And uh, here's one that's already been done. So uh, that this ought to just work. Oh. Not 
plugged in for it. Great.